Down. Set. Hike. <laughs> You're getting ahead in life. I tried. <laughs> I'm heartless though, so. Oh, uh, it's all right. Oh, I'm, thank you. I'm totally dead inside, so it's cool. What's that saying? I'm not heartless. I learned how to use my heart less. <laughs> I don't have one. Mm. Okay. Yeah. You can't have to be too picky, you know? You can't be too picky, you know? I, well, I tried, and Cupid did me wrong, you know? Yeah. Good luck with that. I heard to stay away from love push number 13. I don't know. Seems fine. Well, that's what happened. They gave me the love push and told me that this guy was going to love me. And then on my wedding day, he ripped my heart out. Oh, okay. Yeah. Right? Yeah. But you got the revenge. But you got revenge, I see. Duh, this is my house. Yeah. It's okay, though. If you ever go to the Blackthorn Inn, just make sure you're careful because that's how I got the idea for this. Uh, okay. She helped me. Nice. Be very careful. All right, well, thanks for the warning. What you wish for. But they say what goes around comes around, so I was like, okay, goes my heart, I get his head, so it's okay. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, so that was pretty cool. This is uh, the same, pretty much the same layout as it has been for the last few houses in here, at least um, the Christmas one, but I believe the previous two, but still pretty good. Uh, the, I got one good jump scare at the very end when I was uh, playing with the laser wall. Some gu one guy just jumped out and went, bah! And I was like, oh, I was distracted by playing with the laser. But a lot of people are, are afraid of the main character. I think that... It's the woman in the um, dining room area. She said I'm late, which is true. I actually am late. She was right about that. Uh, and I know the rules, which, again, legitimate. Um, I believe I made it out alive, but who's to, who's to say? Going live? Why? Why? Why are you scared? Going live when you're dead. So, on to the second one. Light provided by the Apple Watch. Love push at number 13. I feel like they went with the theme a lot better. Um, I can follow the story a little better, uh, if that makes any sense. So I saw Cupid twice in there, and lots of people are telling you don't take the love potion. Um, one of them is telling me I can't, or I'll end up dead. Okay, uh, is that bad? I, I don't know. But pretty good walkthrough, pretty good house. Um, line not too bad. I kind of bought my ticket last minute, so I went through the regular journal admission, but still pretty cool. So let's check out the place. That was dumb. As always, you can get Sir Henry's Hunted Trail socks. And of course, the books. New merch alert, we got the poppy shirt. It's new for this event. And then there's these insulated mugs people seem to love for whatever reason. I mean, they're all right. 
Pins, stickers, magnets. Similar to what they always have, but these are, you know, obviously different for Love's Revenge. Over here in Cupid's Corner, we've got these lovely light up flowers, which uh, light up roses, excuse me, for five dollars. Not bad, actually. Popcorn. That is six dollars. Got some. How is this? What am I doing? Here? Over here, fudge. Oh, fudge. Four dollars. <laughs> those things. How delicious, whatever that is. Well, that is it for me for night two of Sir Henry's Love's Revenge. This is the last year, this was the first haunted event that I went to for Dave Spook Central. And of course, I'm back again a year later. So, Thanks for watching this video. Uh, subscribe if you feel like it, I guess. But remember, haunt season never ends.